Hi everybody! This video is slightly different from the ones that we have done previously since we have an inclination in this isometric drawing. So to start drawing this one, we first right select uh, the axis and right click on them. And from here, rotate axis, we want to rotate the axis around Z axis at an angle, let's assume that this angle is 30. And I think it's 30. Okay, now we start drawing. But before that, we, uh, we turn the earth on. We start drawing the internal part by selecting the line tool and drawing a distance of 20. Change the isoplane by pressing F5 and 20 again. F5, then 20, then C. Now we draw an isocircle. And also here. Now we draw another line of 40. This line is a reference for the other isocircle that you will draw and this one also. Now to trim, select the lines and trim the bigger circles. And also select them again and trim the internal circles. Okay. Now draw another line from here, extending a distance of 15 and copy this line from this point to this point to this point. Okay. Now delete this one and draw another line and copy this half circle from here to here and this one also from here to here copy again this line from here to the quadrant and trim select this one and trim this copy again this line and this line from this point to this point and trim trim as we see here we have a distance of 10 plus 20 plus 10 that is 40 plus 5 Okay, that is 42 up to this uh, line. So, we copy this line, the 40 from here, a distance of 10 plus 10, that is uh, 20. Okay, and move it from here up to here oh sorry we draw another line going in this direction okay let's make it up to here and copy this line 
from the this point a distance of 20 now trim this one and this one and this one also now from here we draw another line extending a distance of 25 and in this direction 30 and 25 again that's it make sure that the distance is 25 okay it's 25 now we draw another line of 15 this line is 15 from here up to here now we draw we copy this line from here up to the midpoint and also copy this line from the midpoint to the midpoint copy it again from here 5 to the right and 5 to the left as it shown here this distance is 10 and we can make sure by making uh, writing dist short for distance distant okay it's 10 now we draw another line from here to here and copy it from here to here okay We notice that the 15, the 15 line starts at the end of 25. So we move these parts from here up to this point. Now we draw isocircle. This one and also this one. and we draw another one starting from here up to here that's good and trim delete everything that is inside now we copy this line and this line a distance of 5 to this direction and we draw this line it's 5 and we go this direction trim this line and and trim this one okay now we draw another line starting from this point to the quadrant sorry to the quadrant not tangent this quadrant and copy this line a distance of 10 we draw another line now 
now we copy this circle from here up to here and trim now draw the last line from here up to here Now we have finished this part, we move to the second part, but uh, as we notice here, we have 20 and 10, that is 30 and 10, that is 40. So we draw a line of 40, and in this direction we have 10 plus 20, that is 30. From the midpoint, we draw a line of um, 20 and another line of 10. Okay, now we select the isocircle and draw a circle from here extending up to here, and another one, another circle from here extending a distance of 10 and we copy this line from here to the center this is done just to trim and uh, now we trim this line and copy this segment uh, yes, copy this segment from here to the endpoints of this arc. Now we draw another line and press F5 to change the isoplane and draw a line of 10 and uh, another line. Now we copy this line from here to here and to here. Okay, no, delete this one and copy this one and this one from this point up to this point. Now trim sorry, delete this one. We had a mistake here before deleting, yes we copy this line from this point up to the end point and move this one from here up to here now delete this, this circle and copy this line and this line from here to here now trim Now we copy this one from here up to here, up to here. And also we copy this line and this line from here to here. And we trim, copy again this one and this one from here to here and trim and last copy is this one from this one to this point and trim
delete the extras this is the end of this video thanks for watching if you have any question just write it in the comments below don't forget to subscribe like and share bye